Good morning, friends. Greetings and welcome to The Bright Side, your nutritional program dedicated to the understanding of the vast world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. I'm your host, Pharmacist Ben, nutritional pharmacist from Boulder, Colorado, registered pharmacist number 12275. I specialize in using nutritional supplements where other healthcare practitioners use toxic pharmaceutical drugs and deadly medical procedures. If you suspect that there are natural nutritional roads to your health and your vitality and your well-being into addressing your health challenges, whatever they may be, but you don't know where to begin, you have come to the right place. As you listen to The Bright Side every day, you are more and more in control of your body, you are more and more knowledgeable, and you know you can overcome any health issue. That's why we're here every day on The Bright Side helping clear up the sometimes confusing world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation over the last 29 years of practicing pharmacy. I've seen drug-free recoveries from diabetes and hypertension and obesity and skin diseases like acne, psoriasis, eczema, rosacea, digestive ailments, autoimmune issues of all kinds, recoveries that by the standards of modern medicine can only be called a miracle but what is in the world of the body, what is in the world of biology, standard operating procedure, because the human body is a healing system, it's a regenerating system, it is designed divinely to heal and renew itself on a moment-to-moment -moment basis, and while some folks may call that a miracle, it really is just the way the body works. If you have questions about health or nutrition or prescription drugs, if you want to get off your meds and get on a good nutritional supplement program, we are here for you. We welcome your calls on the bright side. 844-236-6010 is our number. 844-236-6010. If you want to purchase any of the Longevity products you hear advertised on the program, please head over to brightsideben.com or criticalhealthnews.com or pharmacistben.com. You can purchase products right off the website. You can also call the Brightside Ben phone team at 866-735-2470. 866-735-2470. And, of course, if you're interested in joining the Brightside Ben team for a one-time $25 fee, you can start yourself a longevity business and help spread the word about the power and importance of a good nutritional supplement program. And if you're interested in purchasing any of my Truth Treatment products, including the Retinol 5% Gel, go to truthtreatments.com, truthtreatments.com. All right, bottom of the hour, we're going to talk to Selwyn Barr. Selwyn Barr of the Bergamax Company. We'll be talking to him about bergamot flavonoids, and we're, we're going to especially be focusing on ED, erectile dysfunction. It turns out that flavonoids and flavonoid supplementation can benefit male sexual performance. Flavonoids in general uh, just have some, uh, so many wonderful benefits. Flavonoids are a component of vegetables, uh, general type of chemical structure. There's two very fascinating chemical structures in vegetables. And most of the time when we hear about plant nutrients or phytonutrients, what they're talking about is one or the other of these two major classes of chemicals that are found in tomatoes and potatoes and apples and pears and pretty much all fruits and vegetables. And animals, too, for that matter, that eat those fruits and vegetables. But our main sources of these two categories of nutrients are fruits and vegetables. They're called carotenes. Everybody's pretty much everybody's heard of beta carotene, but there's lots of different carotenes. There's hundreds of different carotenes. And flavonoids. And there's probably more flavonoids than there are carotenes. Probably on the order of a thousand different flavonoids that we know of. Now, flavonoids and carotenes are not considered to be vitamins, or uh, I should say they're not considered to be essential nutrients. You've got 90 essential nutrients. But I think that they're only non-essential because when we came up with the essential nutrients, I don't know, 80 years ago or so, 70 years ago, probably in the 1920s to 1940s is when they dis established all the essential nutrients. They didn't have the detection mechanisms that we have today. The electron microscopes and the nuclear magnetic resonance, NMR machines, and all these HPLC machines, these high-tech machines that are uh, were developed over the last maybe 50 years or so, weren't available when the essential nutrients were being listed, when they were being discovered. And so flavonoids and carotenes, because they're only present in very, 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 very tiny concentrations, didn't get recognized as being essential. But I suspect that these flavonoids and carotenes, 
and generally you'll, you'll hear, hear the term sometimes bioflavonoids, and that ge generally means all the flavonoids. They tend to be colored. They're very protective for this, uh, against the sun and against environmental damage, against oxid oxidation damage. They're basically protective elements. And they do a lot of other things too, but one of their major, major roles, one of their major functions in the human body is to protect us. So plants, as it turns out, make fundamental protection molecules. They're called flavonoids and carotenes. And it turns out that the bergamot plant, and the, I should say the bergamot fruit, which is kind of a cross between a lemon and an orange, it's not very edible, it only grows in a few places, it turns out that the bergamot fruit has got some really, really cool flavonoids in it that aren't found in any other, at least that we know of, any other uh, fruit or vegetable, and Selwyn Barr will be talking to us about that in the bottom of the hour. Okay, we'll take your calls into our, in our next segment at 844-236-6010, so call in now and we'll get your calls in our next segment. I just want to touch on a few things before we go to our break. Yesterday we were talking about the simplicity of the healing process and the simplicity of how the breakdown of the body initiates and the, how it proceeds. It's really logical. It's common sense. It's plumbing. The body is a, a, a fluid system, and that fluid, I mean, everybody's probably heard that we're two-thirds water, right? We're 60 to 70 percent water. The body is a fluid system, and much of that fluid is circulating. We, what we call the blood and we call the lymph, and even to a certain extent what we call the bile, these are fluid systems that have to circulate. The, the science of how fluids circulate is called fluid dynamics, hydrodynamics. And fluid dynamics and hydrodynamics, from a biological standpoint, the movement of fluid, the movement of blood, is all you need to know if you want to heal yourself. It's all you need to know if you want to live a good life, a good long life. It's all you need to know if you want to prevent disease, is the, how fluids move and the relationship of the dynamics, the movement of the fluid to good health. As fluids move, and specifically I'm talking about the blood, but it could be the, the bile too and the lymph, as fluids move, stuff is delivered to cells and stuff is removed from the cells. So why yesterday we said it's all about dirty blood. Once the blood becomes dirty, it doesn't deliver nutrients as well. Once the blood becomes dirty, it doesn't detoxify uh, as well. And once the blood becomes dirty, it doesn't deliver oxygen as well. And these are the three ways the body breaks down. We've talked about it so many times, but we never really related it to the blood. But what's the good news here? What's the cool thing here? Oh, by the way, when the fluid is moving around, when the blood is moving around, it's generating an electrical current too. So as the fluid starts to clog up, as the fluid, the blood starts to get dirty and clump up, not only is it not delivering oxygen, not only is it not delivering nutrients, the mighty 90 essential nutrients, the vitamins, the minerals, the EFAs, not only is it not delivering oxygen, but the electrical energy that's generated as the fluid is moving, that's slowing down. The, the, there's less and less electrical energy. This is all following dirty blood. This is all following the entrance of toxicity, and that includes sugar, in through the digestive system. That's why it's so important to focus on that point. I don't talk about food and the digestive system because I'm some kind of health, health nut. I'm talking about it because it's how we get sick. At the end of the day, it's plumbing. Fluid dynamics, hemodynamics, the movement of fluid, it's how everything's plumbed, how everything's put together in a piping situation, how the fluid is moving through these pipes. So once you start to uh, stop the stream of toxicity, and this is why fasting is so beneficial, that's the reason why fasting is beneficial. It immediately allows the body to cleanse itself. Fasting is the best cleanse you could do because it'll allow the body to cleanse itself once that stream of toxicity stops entering into the fluid system. And then you start patching up the gut. You use all the things we talk about, the bone soup and the glucogel caps and the probiotics. These are all used to patch up the gut. There's no way your chronic degenerative disease is not going to reverse. And there's no drugs that can do that. There's not a single prescription drug on the planet that can repair your gut. There's not a single prescription drug on the planet that can clean your blood. But does it matter? No. Because we don't need prescription drugs. We don't need medical strategies. We can do it all ourselves. And that's the good news. That's the bright side. 
All right, I'm Pharmacist Ben, 844-236-6010 is our number. We'll be back right after this. We'll take your phone calls, uh, 844-236-6010. We'll take your phone calls in our next segment. Back on the bright side, 844-236-6010 is our number. Talking about flavonoids and carotenes, seaweeds are one of the best sources of flavonoids and carotenes, and this is one of the reasons why flavonoids and carotenes are so powerful, and this is one of the reasons why, I'm sorry, why seaweeds are so powerful, and this is one of the reasons why seaweeds and seaweed products have uh, multiple wide-ranging health benefits. Seaweeds are especially rich in flavonoids and carotenes, and you can tell by their incredible coloring. You ever see flor- uh, seaweeds up close? They're almost fluorescent when they're healthy, and that fluorescence is a manifestation of their, uh, at least partially a manifestation of their flavonoid and carotene content. Flavonoids and carotenes have an ability to, to absorb light. And this ability to absorb light is what accounts for their incredible benefits and their incredible beauty. The beauty of the natural world is a largely a function of flavonoids and carotenes. And when I say the beauty of the natural world, I'm talking about the colors of the natural world, the reds and the blues and the violets and the, all the beautiful hues that are, that are surround us everywhere. Even artificial stuff, even like bricks are red because of ultimately because of uh, elements like carotenes and flavonoids. Even uh, artificial structures get their color from um, flavonoids and carotenes, at least to a certain extent. Uh, Minerals, uh, mineral elements also, um, obviously they're non-flavonoid or non-carotene, but actually the flavonoids and carotenes are, they absorb their light because they're minerals ultimately. In any case, flavonoids, carotenes, the reds, the blues, the greens, the oranges, the violets of the fruit and vegetable world of the plant kingdom are much more than beautiful to look at. They are actually very good for you. Eat your rainbow. All right. 844-236-6010 is our number. Let's go to Susie in Ohio. Welcome to the Bright Side. What's up? Hey, thanks for taking my call. I have a friend who's got um, sinus problems. Do you have any suggestions for that? Yes, that's a very good question because that, uh, that's a classic example of the problem is not the problem. You follow me? The sinus mm-hmm. infection seems like it's the problem, but it's a sign of the problem. It's a sign of an overloaded and overworked defense system. Are you with me? Yes. Usually the body will resolve infections. I, and I, when you say sinus infection, I, I, I assume you mean one that's not resolving or somehow right. it's not getting better. Usually the body will take care of that. In fact, the body will take care of these bacteria that cause the sinus infection to such a great extent that, that we won't even know that the body's taking care of it unless it becomes overloaded, either overloaded because there's a lot of bacteria present or overloaded because it's doing too much work. Now, you can't control the bacteria that are present because we live in a planet of bacteria, but you can control your immune system. You can strengthen your immune system. The first thing you want to do is remove any other burdens on the immune system. That usually means digestion. Where is the bulk of your immune system located? Do you know? I'm assuming your digestive system. Very good. Good assumption. That's exactly where it is. The vast majority of immunity is in the digestive tract. So if you have a sinus infection, you'll be like, well, what's that got to do with my digestive system? Well, sinus infection is an immune system issue. It's not resolving. The immune system's not taking care of business. So you want to work on the immune system, and if 80% of it is in the digestive tract, that's where you want to work first. Probiotics, good bacteria, wonderful for taking care of bad, of bad bacteria. So that's the first thing to do. Bioluminightly essence, three in the morning, three at night, fermented food. You know, probiotics, good bacteria. Apple cider vinegar also helps keep the gut, the environment of the gut hospitable to good bacteria. So using apple cider vinegar and digestive enzymes after your meals. As far as getting rid of that infection right away, you can do things like vitamin C and the Beyond Tangy Tangerine. Sip on that all day long. In fact, when you're even feeling a cold coming on, taking a bunch of your BTT and using vitamin C can be very helpful for keeping the, the, the cold from happening. As far as the sinus infection goes, vitamin C is powerfully anti-infective, powerfully antibacterial. Uh, and in addition to being supporting your immune system. Zinc 50 milligrams, you know, I, I find it interesting that zinc has so many different benefits for the body, yet it's one of the major nutritional deficiencies that we have, and it's really cheap to get enough zinc in your system. It costs you a penny a day, 
Now, she's not on zinc and she has, a, uh, or your friend is not on zinc and has a sinus infection, that's going to make a huge difference, 50 milligrams of zinc. Keep your sugar intake down to zero if possible or as little as possible. That means bread and pasta and all that good stuff uh, that we all love so much and fruit juice too and desserts. Of course, that goes without saying. And then practice slow, deep breathing. Get on a rebounder. These are all strategies for helping build your immune system. And then the sinus infection, the immune system will take care of the sinus infection, that will go away on its own. That's how I like to work on the bright side. Does that make sense? Perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you. God bless you. Have a beautiful day. All right. uh, Let's go to RC. What's up, buddy? Hey, RC. Ben. Hey. Hey, I've I've got a friend. Well, first of all, I want to say, you know what attracted to me me to listening to you the first time? was your. your, It's almost like poetry, the way you... uh, you explain things, and it's so simple and uh, wow, just wonderful. Just Thank wonderful. you. I appreciate that. Thank you. I really appreciate that. That, that means you're, it, it makes sense, right? It, you get it. it yeah. It's not complicated. They want us to think it's complicated. Power, tr- you know, that's why legalese. Do you ever go to court, RC, and you have to try oh, to understand God. a con? Legalese is, a, is the same thing. It disempowers us. And it's not right. It's not fair at the end of the day. Go ahead, RC. I didn't. Yeah. Um, Obfuscation. I, I had a friend sent me a, a, a guy named Dr. Galvez talking about a. Okay. He's going to make a presentation on lunacy. I know about that. Where is he going to do that? In Santa Cruz? In Monterey. Okay, well, you know, he's, he's interesting, but it's, a, it's the medical model. It's the idea of, it's lunacy for the listeners. That's, uh, it, it's a cancer, anti cancer molecule, it's about killing cancer. So this guy, Dr. Uh, and he's a smart guy, obviously. Uh, he's a professor at uh, UC Davis, I think, in California, somewhere in yeah, California. Yeah. UC Berkeley or Davis, somewhere up there. He's at Davis. He's yeah. at Davis. Okay. So he has he discovered that there's this anti-cancer compound, a protein, a peptide called lunacin, comes from soy. And yes, it's true. Plants make anti-cancer compounds, but cancer is not an issue of killing things. You don't, yes, it's true, lunacin has medicinal properties, but it's part of the entire plant, and to try to target a specific molecule is a a drug company strategy that patents things, controls things, and is basically not in our interest. It's in business interest. If it was really in our interest, we would say cancer lives in an environment that's conducive to cancer. Cancer lives in a, a context of cancer. We work on the environment that the cancer is living in. And who controls that? We do. We control through the foods we eat, through the air we breathe or don't breathe, through the toxins we get or don't get, through uh, uh, spiritual t- uh, strategies, mental strategies, emotional strategies. These are all the ways that healing is supposed to occur. And I find it offensive as a human being that there's this profession that purports to control the healing process. I find that personally offensive to, you, to me personally and to humanity in general. And I don't appreciate it. You know, if we really care about people's health, we'll be focusing on the things that are causing the, the disease. Nobody has a lunacin deficiency. Do you need, uh, you know, chemotherapy if you have a tumor and there's some magical thing that will kill a tumor? That's great. I understand that. And, you know, I'm all for that. But if we focus on the context, ultimately we're working at the causal level and ultimately we have control. We become powerful. This is a, a message of empowerment at the end of the day. Thank you, RC. I appreciate it. And thanks for the kind words, buddy. All right. We're coming back talking some flavonoids and bergamot with Selwyn Barr on the bright side. Don't go away. back on the bright side thank you for being here we're on the air monday through friday eight to nine pacific and 10 to 11 central time 24 7 at brightsideben.com you can purchase any of the longevity products you hear advertised on the program brightsideben.com and you can also go to criticalhealthnews.com or pharmacistben.com and you can also go to brightsidehealthproducts.com if you're interested in purchasing any of our bergamax product I've been talking about bergamot now for oh, going on six months or so, probably six or nine months. When I first heard about bergamot, I was blown away, and I said that you guys need to check this product out. You need to use this product, and I wanted to make it available, and I don't do that a lot. I'm very careful about the products that I suggest, but when I heard about bergamot, 
I was com completely blown away. And then the more I heard about it, the more blown away I was by it. Uh, basically, it has these flavonoids that we've been talking about. Anyway, I got introduced to it uh, through a couple of physician friends of mine, and then uh, uh, they directed me to our guest, Selwyn Barr, who is the founder of uh, Nat, Health, uh, Nat Health Solutions. I hope I'm saying that right, because I hadn't heard that before. Nat Health Solutions. I talked to Selwyn last year, and we got together, and we agreed to sell the Bergamax uh, my, uh, the Bergamot via Bergamax on brightsidehealthproducts.com. And since then, uh, the research that has come out on this particular type, as we'll find out, this is a particular type of Bergamot. Uh, the research that has come out specifically on this particular type of Bergamot has been just pretty, pretty darn overwhelming, I have to say. And I've been in the business for a long time, and I'm very pleased and honored to have uh, Selwyn Barr on, the founder of Nat Health Solutions. I said that correctly, right, Sal? Yes, you did. Uh, okay, yeah. good, good. So, Sal, you're an uh, engineer, you're a mechanical engineer by training, and then I noticed that you're a horse, horse trainer and driver. That's kind of interesting. Uh, and then also uh, you founded the uh, Cold Rock Ice, cr ice Creamery. Is that how you say it? The Ice Creamery that's in yeah, Australia. That's correct. Okay, Ice Creamery in Australia. And then you got involved with Bergamot. So, first of all, how did you get involved with Bergamot? Uh, well, I'd semi-retired, Ben. I'm 68 years of age, and five years ago I would sort of, um, you know, thought my body needed a break and anyway an opportunity came up a friend of mine uh, whose brother's the major shareholder in the company in Italy that produces the extract there's only one company in the world that produces the extract um, and it sounded interesting and I thought well you know, I should have a further look into it and the more I looked into it the more um, enthusiastic I got and the, and the fact that I thought it could help me personally which it has we could help a lot of people um, along the way with the product and the product in that five year period that I've been involved, the product's probably twice as beneficial now as what it was then. Now what makes, what is it about, there's bergamot everywhere, but there's something special about this one. There's a couple of special well, things about this one. Well, it, it's not so much special, I mean, you know, Bergamot trees are, are grown in Australia, in California, um, in parts of Africa, Canary Islands, Mexico. Israel. But it's 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 just the specifics. There's a microclimate around that bottom southern part of Italy. Down, in, I don't know whether your your listeners know, but you know, it, Italy shaped like a boot, so it's like around the toe area and the ball of of the boot. So it's a very specific, smallish region. Is it a volcanic yeah, area? Is there a vo is that yeah, a volcanic? Very, very volcanic. Yeah. Uh, you know, I've been to the orchards there on a number of occasions, and and it looks that you can't see any soil or dirt at all. It looks like the trees are growing in a gravel yard, but but that's the volcanic, and you've got to dig down about one metre before you'd actually come to what we call soil. So, so it's, it's a microclimate that. The climate comes off the top of Africa, hits that region, and spins off like a vortex. So there's a whole range of factors that, that contribute to having a unique blend of polyphenols or bioflavonoids um, that are in this fruit that aren't in the fruit grown anywhere else in the world. Now, one of the neatest things about your, this particular product, and I know uh, I, it's called Bergamet, right? Is that the particular na the name of yeah, this? Yeah, Bergamet and Bergamet, yeah. What's cool about the Bergamet uh, that grows, is that Calabria, by the way? Is that what you're talking about? Yeah, it's, it's from Calabria, correct. Calabria. So this area, uh, there's universities in this area that are, like, making a living studying this stuff, Correct. Yeah, the University of Catanzaro has done a lot of work on the extract, and, and that's been funded by the university and the uh, Italian government. They gave Professor Malachi, who's the lead researcher um, at the University of Catanzaro and on the bergamot extract, um, 40 million euros over the last two years, uh, primarily for uh, research and to build the best research facility in all of Europe. Uh, and which it has, and they, they, University of Catanzaro now has the the best equipped lab in all of Europe. And they're specifically targeting the polyphenols that are in this bergamot. The, the, the yeah, bergamot. Absolutely, yeah, because absolutely, because it's part of all of the scientists and cardiologists and, and researchers that are involved. All what 
where their where their interest comes from. They all grew up in the area where the fruit's grown, so it's like you know something that's it's part of them, and and that's why you know so much work and research has been done into the into the product because of their you know it's their their um, homeland and and the area where they grew up and and where it's been shown to be you know have enormous benefits in a large number of areas. I wonder if the Mediterranean diet, all the benefits of the Mediterranean diet, have something to do with the with, with the same kind of potency in the soil. Well, yeah, I believe so. Yeah. I mean, hand in hand, if you know, probably the healthiest thing you could do in the world is is be on a Mediterranean diet and take yeah. Burger Met, Burger Max um, yeah. a, as a supplement, because you know the, the the problem for us is. It sounds like the greatest snake oil story of all time. I know, but, I know. I, I was but, telling, I was talking about that. It's I, just, there's so many know, different I've things. Taken, I've taken that call thousands of times in the last five years, and and I say to people, I agree 100. percent But it is what it is. So I don't know what else to say. Because you're working, Sal. You're working at a fundamental level, and everything is upstream. That, or everything's downstream. I mean, if you're working at the basic level, and then everything you get all these multiple benefits downstream. So Absolutely. it makes it makes perfect sense. Now, speaking of benefits, there are so many. I don't even know where to focus on. But to me, the metabolic syndrome, the liver and the metabolic syndrome. This is what got my friends, you know, Doc, Dr. Dragel and Dr. Ehrlich, who we've had on the program. This is what got them involved. Is they got blown away by the benefits that this stuff had for metabolic syndrome. So talk a little bit about about as a layperson. I know you're not a doctor, but you're an engineer, and you can you understand engineering. If you understand the engineering, you understand the body. Is the way I look well, at it. You know, I've, you know, a lot of people think I'm a doctor, but I've been, you know, bear in mind I've been exposed to some of the best research scientists, cardiologists in the world for five years, Ben, so I have a fairly good understanding. Metabolic syndrome is just a set of risk factors, um, and this is the only, Burger Met, Burger Max is the, is the only product, single product on the market that addresses all of the risk factors of metabolic syndrome so, and, and, and the liver, for that matter. Uh, so. Okay, we got, hang on, Sal. we got to take a break. When we come back, let's talk about exactly some, the, the specifics of metabolic syndrome, the blood pressure in the liver and uh, the cardiovascular implications and how Bergamet addresses that. And then you have some interesting things to say about erectile dysfunction, about ED. So I want to cover that as well. I'm Pharmacist Ben. You're listening to The Bright Side. We're talking Bergamet and Bergamox with Selwyn Barr. And uh, we'll take a break and come back with more good stuff, good health information. Don't go away. All right, we're back on the bright side, talking some bergamot. Bergamot. If you're interested, uh, you want to check out any of the uh, the uh, bergamot products, you, you can go to brightsidehealthproducts.com. Brightsidehealthproducts.com. We're talking to Selwyn Bar, Nat Health Solutions. So Selwyn. Metabolic syndrome. What are some of the symptoms of metabolic syndrome, and how does uh, how does the Bergamet address that? Well, it's got a number of risk factors: is cholesterol, triglycerides, blood pressure, blood glucose, and weight. I mean, they're the risk factors of metabolic syndrome. So, <clears throat> Bergamet Bergamax is the only single product in the world that addresses all of those risk factors. And as we alluded to, and you spoke about earlier, you know, it's because of the u- unique blend of the polyphenols that are in the that are in the fruit. So all of the products are the juice and the pulp of a citrus bergamot. Um, so it's got uh, those factors which contribute to uh, reducing um, metabolic syndrome. You know, there's, there's 75 to 80 million people in America with metabolic syndrome. Um, Hi, so just, to, a, just to reinforce, well, pretty much all the things that people complain about when it comes to their circulatory system, yeah. elevated blood pressure, uh, uh, ser- cholesterol and triglycerides, risks for heart disease, not to mention obesity, probably bone disease too, osteoporosis I think might be part of metabolic syndrome, and then the liver is involved as well. There's a big liver component, no? Yeah, absolutely. and and. I don't know whether your listeners would know, but statistically in America, you have at least 70 million Americans with non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. More even. Seven, including 7 million children. So Is that crazy? 7 million children. So kids, so, so kids would benefit from this too. Absolutely. 
absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Because there is no product on the market at the moment that that can really work on on fatty liver. Um, so it's a it's an area where a lot of people aren't that familiar with it, but it's being regarded as the epidemic of the 21st century. Um, some countries around the world have alarming numbers. Just just one, for instance, nothing to do with the US. In Taiwan, 60 percent of people over 40 years of age, men and women, have fatty liver. So that's the that's uh, and that's fairly consistent around the world. And and Burger Med Burger Max is the is the only product that can address uh, fatty liver by changing the function and the structure of the liver. You know, you say 70 million, uh, and I think it might even be more than that. But the thing is, you don't have to have a diagnosis of fatty liver disease to already have a fatty liver. I mean, it's no, progressive. You know what I'm saying? I, I, sorry, I would suggest that probably 80% of people with yeah. fatty liver don't realize they have fatty liver. Yeah, it's not like you don't have to have a diagnosis. We're all pretty much because our livers are all compromised. And one of the, the cool things about this flavonoid, and I think everything works via this mechanism, I would guess, at least mostly, and that is that it's protective for the liver. It's a, it's a liver protective substance, and that's why it works for metabolic syndrome. That's why it works for liver disease. I, I think, does that make sense to you? Yes, absolutely. That, that's exactly right. So I, that, that sounds like the mechanism, and it also has to do with uh, uh, how the blood flows because the liver is filtering the blood to a certain extent, right? That's one of the things that the liver does. So it improves the circulatory system in general, and one of the ways it manifests this, uh, this kind of uh, this beneficial effect on the circulatory system manifests is, as, uh, as it turns out, for erectile dysfunction, ED. That's correct. Yeah. And now, to me, that's one of the most exciting things of all. T talk about that a little bit. Yeah, we, we've spent the um, the last 12 months um, looking at at a um, the benefits of of the extract on um, diabetic men with ED, and virtually every diabetic man has ED issues. So we started formulating, and the scientists at the University of Rome started looking at 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 the product to see that. And we just completed a study earlier this year where we did a study on 60 patients over a 120 day period just with um, this, the products like Burger Met, Burger Mac. Um, and at the end of that, it showed a 30% improvement in the inter international index of erectile dysfunction. So the, the product alone, since then we've, we've, done, we've uh, formulated another product again with the extract as the main ingredient, but with a couple of other products, which has proven to be, um, you know, more significant again. So we should have that product out shortly. Um, we're just we're just finishing the trial. The trial will be published next month that, uh, you know, that, on PubMed. PubMed. That, that's one of the most exciting things, and that's really what got my attention. One of, and one of the most exciting things about the product is the fact that there's so much research behind it. I mean, if you go on, if you look up PubMed or you look up scholar.google.com, You'll get research on all Bergamot in general. There's a lot of good stuff on there, but on this particular product, there's a lot of research on it. Just on this particular product. Yeah, that, that's absolutely right. It's probably the most, you know, clinically and 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 scientifically based product, natural product ever. I mean, what stands us apart from others? And I don't want to be disrespectful to other natural products, but all, all of our products have been clinically tried. The, the full product not just one or two ingredients in the product and i think that i think that makes us stand out from from the crowd is the fact that that we trial the actual product um and and i don't believe that i've seen that actually with with any other product to any great extent and i i love the idea that you guys have the resources to spend because it's the Italian government at the end of the day that's doing a lot of this stuff. You have the resources to spend to have the, the kind of quality research that you need, that has to be done. And that's what a lot of things are lacking because you, you have resources that other companies don't have. 
you know, having those government resources, and that accounts for a lot of that. And I love the research. But tell me, you told when I was talking to the phone, you told me uh, some really neat anecdotal stuff, stuff that you'd heard, right? Some of the people that you'd worked with personally. Tell, why don't you tell the listeners some of the uh, personal stories that you've that you've heard other people share with you about the about the Bergamot? By the way, BrightsideHealthProducts.com, BrightsideHealthProducts.com, if you want to yeah, check it out or purchase a, the product. Yeah, we've, we've got, um, you know, we've got tens of thousands of patients on. We've sold, we've sold over 800,000 bottles in that five-year period, and, and we shipped to, like, you know, uh, 12 countries. But we've had some amazing stories. Um, an 84-year-old lady that um, I picked up the phone three years ago in Australia and took her call, and she just wanted to reorder, and... And uh, she said, you know, it had been a benefit to her cholesterol, but she said the best benefit she'd ever had. She suffers from arthritis really badly, and she said since since commencing Bergamet, her arthritis was the best it's been in 25 years. Mm. And and that's something that really, um, you know, tugs at your heartstrings a bit because, you know, someone of 84 years of age, you, and if people have suffered with arthritis, they you know, they know how terrible the condition is, especially as you get older. So you know instances like that. Uh, we've got we've got diabetic men that have been uh, able to reduce their uh, blood glucose medication um, when you when you add bergamot uh, on a daily basis. Um, you know huge reductions in weight with with um, uh, many people. Now it's not a it's not a fast weight loss product, but there's a gentleman in Australia that's been on the product for four and a half years. And just recently, he sent me a photo, and he's late seventies, can't exercise, not very mobile at all. But in the space of four and a half years, he's lost five inches on his belly. And, and actually, a few months ago, he sent me a photo of his, of his belt, um, and and he, you know, he was excited by that. So, of course, the blood sugar, again, the, the the metabolic syndrome, all that, all the whole metabolic syndrome markers, everything improves, absolutely. everything improves really. Because it's all, you know, yeah. the metabolic syndrome, the blood sugar, the liver, everything that we suffer from by way of autoimmunity, by way of weight problems, by way of heart disease, uh, probably even cancer, all follow these fundamental breakdowns. And the flavonoids and the, and the, the exclusive flavonoids in the, in the bergamot, their, their ability to protect the liver and keep things running efficiently upstream or, or downstream, I guess you would say. Uh, there, to me, that is, that's some powerful, powerful stuff. Uh, thank you so much, Selwyn. So it's brightsidehealthproducts.com, brightsidehealthproducts.com for metabolic syndrome, for ED, for blood pressure issues, uh, lots of other things as well. Anyway, brightsidehealthproducts.com. Thanks, Sal. Talk to you again soon. Yeah, yeah thanks, Ben. Appreciate it. Okay, bye. bye-bye. All right, so uh, if you're interested in checking out the product or uh, you want more information, you go to brightsidehealthproducts.com. And, of course, if you're interested in joining the Brightside Ben team, call the phone team, 1-866-735-2470. Thanks for listening, friends. Have an awesome, wonderful, beautiful day. We'll talk to you all later. Bye for now.